Hey, this is Stay Puffed, and we're doing another toy review. This is kind of like a test run. We got a new camera, in case you can't tell. Um, so let us know what you think of what we're doing. Um, anyway, so this time I have a real beat up looking Heisenberg. As you can see, it's beat to hell. Um, I got it at a discount store where they sell it's they sell weird stuff. But anyway, they just start selling like beat up toys, um, and so I picked up this Heisenberg there for like eight bucks. Um, anyway, so this is a 12-inch Breaking Bad figure of Heisenberg made by Mezco. Um, so let's go ahead and open this guy up and see what it looks like. So as you can see, there he is with all of his wonderful stuff. And he's got lots and lots of wonderful zip ties. Alright, so now that I've had all the technical difficulties of trying to get Mr. Heisenberg out of the box here, um, he comes with two sets of glasses. He stands like Frankenstein. His feet are very square. I was going to let you know that. Anyway, two sets of glasses. Right there. As you can see, they're a little bent. Um, they're real flimsy. Kind of. Right, right. Anyway, um, Mesco made uh, all the South Park figures back in the day. And he's got a lot of articulation here. I have to say, I really like this figure. His feet are padded on the bottom so he won't scuff up things. I mean, like, they really thought about the adult collector when they made these, considering that they try to get them pulled from all the Toys R Uses. Anyway, hat fits perfectly. Is that sinister looking enough? What do you think? Sinister, sinister. All right. Anyway, so um, the details in this thing are really good. He's got the furrowed brow, you know, the serious face. His nose looks a little bit bigger than it is in real life, I think. Anyway, um, I guess we'll go ahead and get a uh, closer look at this fella here, so that way we can kind of get a better opinion about him. Alright guys, so this is the Heisenberg figure close-up. Um, so as you can see, look at all the wrinkles there. I'll go around. So you can see. So his hat fits on perfectly, like it really does. Um, his head goes all the way around. As you can see, he's got wrinkles in his forehead there. Um, the glasses come off. Look at that scowl. And then you can put on the other glasses. And he looks normal, like Walter White. Heisenberg, Walter White. Heisenberg. All right, anyway. So as you can see, he's got lots of detail here. We go around and around. I'll just scan down so you guys can see the whole wonderful thing there. As I was saying, his feet are padded. So that way they don't, aren't tough or messing up anything. He's real lightweight and only his arms move as you can see here. But they're kind of soft and they feel like hollow. I roughed him up a little bit. Alright, so guys get it it's pretty cool it stands up pretty well um it's well balanced uh but like i said it's kind of lightweight for a figure it does have good detail i mean even his uh ring hands got the ring on it and he's got veins in his hand it's kind of cool um but uh for i don't know what the retail price of this thing was probably like 40 bucks i'd imagine um i wouldn't pay that much for it i only paid like eight or nine dollars for this so i think i kind of got a steal but um, I think he's kind of cool for what it is. So if you guys like Breaking Bad and you like Mezco, I would say pick this guy up. He's pretty cool. I don't think I paid retail price for him though. Um, Cause like I said, he's pretty lightweight and not as solid as some of the other figures that are made by different companies like NECA. All right, thanks guys. Hope you enjoy this review.